name is Lauren Wilson, and today I'll be discussing the anatomy and the physiology of the liver. So let's go ahead and begin. So the liver is found in the abdomen, abdominal area of the body. So here we have the abdominal area, and here is where we'll find the liver. Um, the liver has four primary lobes. The right lobe, which is here. Um, the right lobe is then separated by a deep fissure from the left lobe. So here's that deep fissure here. And then we have the left lobe here, which is the smaller portion of the liver on the anterior portion. Um, on the uh, posterior portion, we have the caudate lobe, um, which can only be seen from the inferior point of view. And then we also have the quadrate lobe, which can also be seen from the inferior point of view which I will show you guys later on another slide. Let's go ahead and continue. So the falciform ligament separates the right and left portion of the liver anteriorly. So here we have the falciform ligament here. And inferior to the falciform ligament runs the round ligament. So going back to that previous slide, so we have the falciform ligament here, and then we have the round ligament that runs beneath it here. The entire organ is then enclosed by the vesicle peritoneum. The lesser omentum anchors the liver to the lesser curvature of the stomach, and then we have the hepatic artery and the hepatic vein into the liver at the Porta hepatis and the common hepatic duct. So, looking at the anterior view again, we have the right lobe here. We have the deep fissure here, the falciform ligament that is here. And then we have that round ligament that runs inferior to that falciform ligament. And then we have the left lobe here. Then, on the posterior side, again, we have that left lobe here and here. We have the right lobe, which is that bigger section. Then we have the caudate lobe that is right in between, or right underneath the inferior vena cava, which is seen here. And then we have the uh, quad quadrant lobe, which is located here next to the uh, gallbladder. We also see the left hepatic vein that is here, that is connected to the inferior vena cava. We also have the hepatic artery proper, which is this red section here. And then we have the hepatic um, portal vein that runs parallel to the hepatic artery. So physiology of the liver. The liver is one of the most important me metabolic organs. Um, it receives oxygenated blood from the heart via the hepatic artery. So going back again to that previous slide, the hepatic, hepatic artery here, which we get that oxygenated blood from. <clears throat> and then the hepatic, uh, art, um, and then we get nutrition-rich blood from the gastrointestinal tract via the portal vein. So again, going back to the previous slide, this is where we'll find that portal vein. Hepatocytes make up 70 to 85% of the liver cell population. They are the key functional liver cells with important roles in uh, the metabolic, circulatory, and endocrine functions. Uh, we'll also find Kupfer cells also found in the liver and our specialized macrophages located on the walls of the liver's um, sinusoids. So a disease that affects the liver would be hepatitis B. Um, hepatitis B is a virus that attacks the liver and leads to uh, inflammation. Um, it is spread when blood, semen, or other bodily fluids from an infected person enters the body of an uninfected person. Um, symptoms include yellowing of the eyes, abdominal pain, dark urine, um, poor appetite, nausea, and fatigue. Um, not all that contract hepatitis B have symptoms. Um, some of them won't 
contract symptoms until chronic stages. Some don't develop any at all. Um, chronic cases can lead to liver failure, liver cancer, or scarring of the liver. About 350 to 400 million people are affected by uh, hepatitis B virus worldwide. The virus triggers immune responses resulting in persistent hepatitic, hepatic inflammation and progressive fibrosis. So some treatment and treatment interventions. Um, one of the approaches to suppress HBV includes antiviral agents and uh, immune-based responses, immune-based therapy. So uh, ribovirin is one of the antiviral agents that are given um, for uh, HBV. Um, is also given to other genotypes of hepatitis, so hepatitis A, B, and C. Um, but there are inhibitors that are specific to each virus that are usually paired with um, one another. Another approach is nucleotide analogs, um, which target the HBV uh, polymerase and interrupt viral DNA uh, replication. It is shown to have reversal and restoration of impaired function on monocyte-derived T cells specific to um, HBV. Uh, recently, this approach has become the standard approach based on the long-term viral suppression results. Um, the increase in antiviral T cells response may increase the HBV control in patients undergoing long-term uh, innate treatment. Uh, hepatitis B virus is also vaccine-preventable infection and is urged for all in individuals to get a prevention of contraction of HBV. Other genotypes, such as uh, hepatitis A, has um, a vaccine as well. Unfortunately, um, hepatitis C does not have a vaccine. So a little biblical discussion regarding the liver. Um, in Lamentations 2.11, it says, My liver is poured upon the earth for the destruction of the daughter of my people because the people because the children and the suckling swoon in the streets of the city. And then it's talked about again in Proverbs 7.22, it says, Till an arrow strike through his liver like a bird has a snare, <clears throat> and know not that it is for his life. The liver is sacred. It is vital and essential to all uh, animal and humankind. Um, an, injury, an injury to the liver can be fatal and we can keep that in mind even when it comes to attacks from diseases and infections. Um, those can cause severe damage to the body and even uh, fatalities. Um, and many times we overlook just how important the liver is to the human life. Um, we don't think severe damage to the, the liver could cause fatalities. And I feel like it's one of the organs that are definitely overlooked. I mean, you think of the heart, you think of the brain. But, you know, God tells us, like, the liver is, is sacred, it is, is very important, it is something that, when attacked, it can cause a, a fatality. 